Hey everyone, as always, Dylan Miller Prospecting. Today, I'm gonna to be doing an unboxing and equipment review. And this is one of the pieces of equipment I use, which is a scale. Now, if you've been watching my videos for a while, you'll actually see I've been using a different scale recently and I was using previously. My old scale was this one, and it's the new one I've got here now, it's a smart way scale. And I absolutely loved it until I dropped it one day. And since then, it has just been fluctuating too much while I'm trying to weigh. So I stopped using it. It wasn't being as accurate because I dropped it. And I dropped it on concrete, unfortunately, and I guess something, I jarred something. So then I switched to my true way, which I like, but it's just, it was fluctuating a little bit too much for me. Um, it's just not as accurate of a scale. It's also has a couple little issues with it that I'm not a fan of, but it does accurate ways within 0. Uh, 0. 0.004. So it's off on off a little bit. This one to me was just a much better scale. Actually, it's the same price. That other scale I had, the true way, I paid $39 for. This one as well, I paid $39.99 for this on Amazon. I believe it's going on sale or it's on sale. It's out of stock, but I believe right now it's $33.99 on Amazon. And it'll be in stock tomorrow, is what they say. But I actually love this one because for $39.99, the stuff you get with it, it is a 50 times 0 0.001 gram scale. So it will do all that fine gold and here's how it comes packaged. One is I love that it comes with a case because then it makes it a lot easier to store. You're not bumping it around everywhere. I tend to bump my scales around a lot, which means I tend to have to calibrate them a lot, which is a real pain in the butt. So comes bagged. Let's unbag this. Let's put, put some batteries in it. It comes with some tweezers, which I will not be using. But it, it is nice. I mean, I have another set of tweezers I use that are non-magnetic. I don't know if these are magnetic. Doesn't feel like they are. But, and then the two calibration weights. Comes with instructions and the three weigh boats. And that's one thing I really liked about this thing was the weigh boats that it came with. Now, I don't use them in my videos just because they're not really big enough to put gold in and a dime. And we all know I have to put my gold dimes in them. You know, I have to have a gold dime in all my videos. So they just don't fit in there. Otherwise, I would use them. I think it's a really great, you know, feature to add stuff like that. Now, let's put these batteries in. Fire this bad boy up. Let's calibrate it. And I'll tell you a little bit more about it when I do that. But let me tell you, this is by far my favorite scale I've ever owned. It's just one of those things where I broke my other one. And this one was out of stock for about six months. And it was really hard on me. And then when it came back into stock, I just didn't have the money. You know, didn't have the money to get a new one. So I was like, well, I'll wait. And I still had that other one that was working. And I said, well... And that's kind of one of those things you all right i love this scale this is my by far my favorite scale and let me tell you i've ordered probably off of amazon i think i did a search earlier just to pull up the information on this for this review and so i typed in my order history scale this was number 11. This was number 11. This is the 11th scale I've purchased off of Amazon. And I'm pretty sure I purchased two or three off of eBay. So I go through a lot of scales. You know, you buy them, you're just not happy with them. They don't measure enough. They're, you know, a little too sensitive. They're not sensitive enough. But let's calibrate this one. This one actually does come with, as you can see, good instructions. Unfortunately, a lot of times the scales you get will come with one of those little one page things with a couple pictures that you can't read. You have no clue what they're doing, but this one actually comes with really, really good instructions. So I'm gonna follow the instructions and I'm gonna check this out and calibrate it up. So let's do that. All right, so I had to read the instructions and figure out how to calibrate it. You know, when you got eight or nine pages, you always have to look through it to find it. So it's pretty easy. 
Just hold the mode button until it says calibrate, let go, push it one more time, a little 20 will pop up, you put one scale down or one weight down, wait till it says 40, put the other weight down, and wait till it calibrates and says pass. Pretty easy to do, you know, I did it and you know, easy. So, with that done, let's turn this off and I'll tell you a little bit more about this scale. It weighs in, as I said, it's a 50 times 0 0.001 gram, gram, gram scale. It weighs in grams, obviously. It weighs in ounces. It weighs in carats. It weighs in troy ounces, penny weight, and grains. Anything you need, I've used it before to weigh my gemstones that come in for carrots. I use it for gold. It's really good if you're wanting to see if you have an ounce of gold. I don't get there that often. I have to sell my pater it off a lot. But a couple other things. It will shut off. This is actually something I don't like about the scale. This is the only thing I don't like about the scale is it shuts off after 60 seconds. Most people will love this feature. Just for me, when you're shooting a video, sometimes I start talking and then I go back to do something and it's off. So that's the only thing that I don't like about it, but it is a good feature. It actually is a good feature so you don't wear out your batteries. And of course, this scale has a thousandth of a gram accuracy. Um, it's plus or minus is 0 0.002. Not too bad. I'm pretty, fan, like I said, I'm a huge fan of this scale. So let me go through my breakdown on what I think of this thing. For value, I'm giving it a score of a 10. For $39.99, I really don't think you can pass it up. There's a lot of cheaper, much cheaper scales you can get on Amazon. I mean, they have $10 scales, $20 scales, $30 scales, 40, all the way up. And I mean, they go up and higher. But like I said, this is my 14th or 15th scale. And this is the second time I've purchased this one. All the other ones have been in the garbage. I mean, I have another one here that I just use for nuggets every once in a while if I don't feel like digging out the other ones but I've gone through a lot of scales and the $20 scales will work but they tend to not be very accurate and usually they're only to the hundredth and the problem with that is when you're off plus or two to four and a lot of these $20 scales are plus four so when you're in a hundredth and you're doing a plus four on there it can really make a difference in your ROI I like this one it's very accurate so value I'm giving it a 10 instructions definitely a 10 now i'm like most people i don't actually read the instructions i play with the thing get frustrated get all red in the face my wife comes gets instructions reads them explains it to me and i say oh wow great product but this one it's got a really good instructions for my wife to read i actually had to read the calibration one because she's not here right now so but there's a lot of other stuff in there that i won't bother to read until i need my wife to do it for me so instructions, giving it a 10. A lot of scales, you know, I believe my last scale I purchased had one page and that was it. And it took me a while to figure out how to calibrate it. This one is pretty easy, like I showed you. So 10 for that. Functionality, it works great. I mean, there's no, my only issue with it, like I said, is that it shuts off after 60 seconds. And to me, that's not a functionality issue. It's just my purposes. You know, what I use it for, I need it on for a couple of times. But you can actually just bump it around a little bit and it'll keep it on, you know, pick it up, put it back down. But so functionality, I'm giving it a 10. Craftsmanship, a 10. I've had no problems with mine ever until I dropped it on concrete and it still even works. It's just sometimes it'll go a little haywire on me and I have to pull out the batteries, put the batteries back in, do that a couple of times, then it'll work perfect for a while, then it'll go haywire again. And when you're shooting videos, it's just not, you know, you don't want to go in haywire in the middle of a video. So. I, I got rid of, I put that one aside and bought a new one temporarily while I waited for this one to get back in stock. Now for customer service and shipping, they're both getting a 10, but that's because it's off of Amazon and you all know how good their customer service and shipping is. So that's a 10. So total score for the smart way scale is a 10. I mean, you really can't go wrong with it. It's like I said, it is more expensive than the typical scales that most people buy, which are around the 17 to $20 range. It is double that, but you know, you get what you pay for. And this is one of those times where sometimes it is better to buy cheaper. This is one of those times where I don't think it is. I really like this scale. And when you're doing something with as, as valuable as gold or gemstones or things like that, it's kind of something you really want a good scale for. So, and especially when you're doing reviews, you really want a good scale. So I didn't mind paying the 40 bucks. In fact, I would pay more. I believe the first time I bought it, I actually believe it was $59.99. And then it went down in price to $39.99, which is I bought it. 
And like I said, I believe it's $33.99 right now, but out of stock, will be in stock tomorrow. This again was a smart way, 50 times 0.001 gram scale. Comes in a nice little case, as you can see. And it comes with the little boats. Right. And this will be in all my new videos coming up. Now, before I do my 24 karat gold plated dime giveaway, before I tell you the name of that, I need to do some shout outs for some of my recent members on my Patreon page. And if you're interested in helping sponsor this channel, you can go to patreon.com forward slash Miller Prospecting. And these are some of my recent members. And there's Bradley White, David Watson, Martin Mastrangelo, Kevin Yu, and John Shaw. And I appreciate all of you, plus the ones that I've mentioned in previous videos. I appreciate all of you, even the people that are just watching this channel, which is in subscribe to this channel, which is why I do these. But I owe some shout outs to the people that are actually sponsoring this channel. And as I said before, you can check out my Patreon page. I'm going to be doing a big giveaway at the end of this month. So, but to what I'm doing now, which is this 24 karat gold plated dime goes to Mojo. And I will be putting up a picture in a few minutes with your name. And if that's you, go to the email address I'll be showing you. And you won yourself a 24 karat gold plated dime from Miller Prospecting. And I'll send that right away. So thanks again, as everyone, as always. And happy panning.